hey guys welcome to my channel so today i decided to do a shopping vlog but before that i wanted to get started by walking at the beach just to start off my day fresh with positive energy lately it has been raining off and on in southern california we've been having heavy rain and flood but today was such a beautiful weather and i cannot miss out so i decided to go out and just you know film a little short walk for you guys i hope you guys enjoy and next up i'm gonna start my shopping blog with pottery barn i actually went looking for a vase the popular vase that everybody has of course is the joshua vase and they were on sale so i wanted to see if i really wanted to get that or not or other things and i wanted to browse through the store and see if there's anything interesting i am currently working i'm doing home decor so slowly but surely it is a bit expensive so i am taking my time finding the right decor aesthetic is time consuming and also could be pricey that's why i decided to browse around and see what i actually like this vase is such a pretty vase but it's not on sale it's 149 dollars which i'm not willing to spend next up i decided to go to hobby lobby i went on two different days so this is just a shopping block that i incorporated into one i was looking at a vase and also other things hobby lobby had 40 percent off i think almost the entire store was on sale um i seen a lot of sale sign but i know some of the vase weren't on sale i love hobby lobby's candles i bought them for years they are 40 percent off and i did splurge on couple and i'm sure i will be back the other item that I wanted to get was these artificial plant. They are 40% off as well. I love this eucalyptus and also the olive branch. I did end up buying the olive um, tree branch, which I really like. It looks so good when you have a nice looking vase that goes with it. Um, I know it's very popular. Those two particular plants, they sell out really quick. So if you come within a day or two, they already sold out. I came back and bought more I think two three days later I ended up finding a few but I bought this eucalyptus here that you guys saw a photo from uh, the marketplace I believe they had 20% off next up shopping blog is gonna be home goods to be honest I came to home goods with the expectation that I would find the items that I really want but it's a hit or miss some days they have a lot some days they do not i was looking for a night lamp too um sets and also i was looking for wall art and then a vase and other decor that i was browsing through i was kind of disappointed i didn't find anything that i liked maybe because i went in the afternoon maybe i have to go in the morning to find things but this is the best home goods that i went to where they carry a large amount of volume of items the other ones don't carry that much but i was disappointed when i browsed through i didn't find anything that i actually like um what else I with Marshall, Home Goods, TJ Maxx, or Ross, any items that you like, I do suggest that you guys buy it right away. If you come back a couple hours later or even the next day, it sells out. It's first come, first serve. And I noticed that a lot of people that own homes end up shopping at Home Goods. I see a lot of people doing home decor a lot. Like sometimes if you go certain days, especially the weekends, it's so busy that <laughs> you, when you carry your cart around, you don't even have any space to walk around. But some of these items do not last. They sell out right away. So um, it's one of those things, like I said, that I would recommend going early this simple human trash can is very popular you guys and i'll show you guys that i found it in marshall these run up to a hundred from a hundred something to two hundred dollars i would highly recommend that you guys check out marshall or home goods they have them for a fraction of the cost i did a little bit of short uh clip uh for you guys and i hope you guys enjoyed it 
Next, we are in the art section of home goods. I was hoping to find something like I stated earlier, but I didn't find anything that stood out. I wanted something for the bathroom and the living room and also my bedroom. But actually for the living room, I found something online, but I wasn't sure really if I wanted to go with that. I just wanted to look around uh, Marshall and home goods to see if I could find something that was a reasonable price point versus shopping online. Um, but I haven't found anything so I'll keep looking uh, it's kind of disappointing <laughs> that I came here but it's okay so I cut it was like a hit and miss so we'll see for next time one of the best items that I bought from home goods in the past maybe three four years ago was a kitchenware like pots and pan the brand called all clad it's such amazing amazing deals that I got I believe I got some of them for like $75, $100 and they retail for $200 to $300 in the past but now they're a bit more pricey because of the inflation and they had a price increase I'm sure but I could not find that on home goods anymore but it was one of the best deals that I found and I still believe I bought a blanket from home goods that have lasted years and years which was a good quality but like I said I bought a lot of these items in the past I noticed that some of these items that have been released into the store are not the same quality as they used to in the past which is a bummer but what could we do okay so next up is Marshall yeah this is a sister company to TJ Maxx and home goods I'm sure a lot of you guys are familiar with this I was so surprised to see so many simple human trash can at Marshall I didn't expect to see all this uh, price point was great it runs from $59.99 to $89.99 and I ended up buying my simple human trash can from Amazon which was $132 US dollar I know it sounds crazy but when I found the same trash can at Marshall for $89.99 I ended up returning my Amazon order and I saved $33 that's why I would recommend for you guys to check Marshall, TJ Maxx and Home Goods. a lot of these name brands out there are available in these stores and I ended up getting this trash can of stainless steel it's 45L the same size as the black ones but it's just stainless steel I love the fact that Simple Human has 2, 5 and 10 year warranty and they're able to replace or fix your trash can if you have any problem I was able to go online on the Simple Human website and register my trash can in case anything happens to it which is gives you kind of like a peace of mind for a while you know especially at that price point you want something that's covered as I was browsing through Marshall I noticed this black vase it's such a pretty vase only for $19.99 but I don't know if I will end up getting this one because I see better vase at Home Goods than Marshall for some reason. Um, I will think about it, but I just wanted to share with you guys. I also forgot to mention to you guys that when I was checking out um, to buy the Simple Human trash can, I did ask the sales associate why the trash can was heavily discounted compared to the online website if you go on Simple Human or Amazon. And I asked her, are they secondhand or are these return items? items she said no these are in brand new condition she said that there's people in the executive higher up who um, meet up with the brand and they negotiate for the price what price point they can buy them for and how much they can sell it for so they end up getting it directly from the company i was really surprised to hear this information but anyways guys this is my shopping vlog thank you for coming with me thank you for joining me this is my first vlog i hope it wasn't boring